Greg, is that sixth inning just an example of how quick this offense can strike? Yeah, yeah. I mean, um, I feel like we can we can wear people down and get to them real quick. Um, have them good at bats the whole game. Um, I felt like we were hitting some balls all right, but uh, definitely. Been productive since you've come back. Was there ever any thought in your mind that, that you wouldn't be able to get into the swing of things offensively? Um, I mean, dealing with injuries, I think – Obviously, you go through ups and downs with what you're thinking. Um, I'll be honest, um, but I, I knew I could get back. Um, it was frustrating because I didn't really have an idea of when. Um, <clears throat> and I mean, we tried different things, and like we didn't get any results. So um, I mean, that was tough. But once I got through this, and once we had the surgery, and, and I started playing again, um, I felt really good, and I was excited. And uh, it's nice to be able to go out and just play my game. How do you feel compared to when you came up in 2015 and now in terms of your confidence and how you're oh, swinging? Better, I think. Just more comfortable. I, I, I don't really want to say better, but just more comfortable. Just with everything, day-to-day -day stuff. Um, I mean, does that? I don't know. Just just more comfortable, really. Um, just know how everything works. Um, you've seen guys now a few times, um, and, and there's experience under your belt. So um, I would say better. I've been asked this before, but did you expect this kind of production after being out so long, both this year and last yeah, year? Yeah, yeah, that's what we were talking about. Um, yeah, I did. I mean, it's just tough dealing with the injuries. Like, the up and down thing is, is the hardest part. Um, like I said, I'm not going to lie. Like, there's there's times where I feel like you get down, but um, really just keep working. I mean, I have great support from my family my friends, and, and <laughs> that means everything to me. So um, never a doubt. There's just, there's just tough times, really. Um, but that's just kind of how it goes. That's life. So for me... Um, I just kept working and, and try to look at things in a positive way and learn what I could and, and knew when I got back and settled in that it'd be good. Were you looking at first place as a team? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I mean, there's still uh, four games left, and, and you never know what can happen. So, obviously, we want to win that division. How much, did, how much did the last couple of days sort of maybe give you guys like a little bit of spark of hope, like, hey, maybe we can? Because it looked pretty bleak Sunday. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, it's we can just win. That's all we can do. Um, and, and I feel like we've done a good job at that. So um, that's our end, and, and that's what we focus on, um, playing our game and doing our thing, and getting our work in, and, and kind of seeing what happens. How much do you feel like you could uh, sneak a peek at the scoreboard? I, I look. I mean, I look. Uh, I know Fred was talking about it. I just look. I mean, I'm not like a <laughs> – I just look. Like, I just almost look right through it. I see it. I probably don't even think about it sometimes. I was looking today, though. Um, and someone when I was on deck was saying the Sox are losing three or four one or something. But then I looked up and it was nine to four, I think. So I missed it a lot there. <laughs> How much um, when you think about the frustration you've had the last two years? Do you feel like you can make up for what's happening? That's been injuries uh, with the, uh, with October. Um, I mean, we want to win games, um, and I mean that's huge. It's it's about winning games and winning games in October. So. Um, for me, being able to do my job and play and, and do what I need to do, that'd be huge. But, um, I mean, I'm not trying to make up for the last time. I'm just trying to play, um, do my thing, and, and be a part of this team. When you were working your way back from surgery and Todd Frazier's here and Chase is at first and doing well there, was there any kind of fear that would you get a real opportunity this year after having injuries the last two years? Um, I mean, in this, you have to prove yourself. Um, what you did yesterday doesn't matter. You got to prove yourself today. So, um, luckily, I was getting some at bats, and and like I mean, I keep saying that I just try to have good at bats, um, put the barrel on the ball, and and swing at strikes, and let the rest kind of take care of itself. Um, but I mean, yeah, there's there's definitely, um, I mean, that went on. It, they're great players, and and I knew I had to come back and and be productive. So, um, just put in the work and and keep playing my game. Great job. Good does this group feel about Luis Severino with the way he put his yeah. regular season together to start potential players? Great. Um, he's, he's had a hell of a year, um, and he knows there's still work to be done. Um, and, I mean, the coolest thing for me is, is he learned. Um, <clears throat> what always made him good in the minor leagues was how smart he was. He always had good stuff, but how smart he was and, like, his command. So this year, I mean, I feel like the command's been there with all three pitches. Um, he's learned how to use it, uh, which is everything. So, I mean, confidence super high in him.